Welcome in, everybody. It is Lazy Shen. Once again, hello. With AI the Somnium Files, episode 7. <laughs> it's so good to be back, guys. I'm, it's been a hot second since I booted up this game, but... Today we're playing a, a, perhaps a little bit under the weather, but I couldn't stop myself, so here we are. If there's like a slight break or you can hear my like halls chewing in the background, pay it no mind. We're here for a good time and not a long time, so welcome in, buckle up, get your drinks, get your popcorn. And we're gonna load up at our most recent save, save number nine. On day, what does it say? Day three, Sunday, at the Gyokei. Hopefully, made uh, cafes. Oh, we're at, the, we're at the Sunfish, that's right. We're at the Sunfish. Let's boot it up really quickly. Get back into the Sunfish. Last time we left off, we drove out into town. We talked to with the boss. We met in, uh, with Mama here, as well as a couple of Yakuza members. Tried to find our good friend, but he was not at the hospital. Turns out, uh, Mizuki was cured all along by her teacher. She was able to uh, regain her ability to speak. And last time we left off, we just finished talking with uh, Oda and the mermaid at the Sunfish. Something here, oil drum. Rusty oil, oil drums. Ota. Ota's sitting opposite of me. So very, very sick. Abyss headquarters is where we're going to go to next. We just found a lead, I believe, after talking with Ota at the Maid Cafe. <laughs> we found out that Ota's a big, big uh, mermaid enthusiast. And that this mermaid in particular has very good uh, hip bones. So let's, uh, let's go to the Abyss headquarters here. Let's go ahead and get our car schmoovin' down the road. Let's go. Oh, Iba's sitting this time. That's cute. Hey, Iba. Iba's sitting in the passenger seat. Let's be precise. The image of Iba sitting in the passenger seat is being sent to my brain. Can you call Iris? I still cannot contact her. Hmm. So she's... Last night... I believe that um, what what's what whatever his name is, I I I keep blanking on his name because he's like only ever mentioned in passing. But last night, what happened is uh, Renju. Uh, we believe that Renju appeared at at Iris's apartment because that's it lines up with the amount of time, like what time Renju broke out of the hospital and what time uh, Iris was forced to end her live stream. And so we think that Renju is there, or at least I do. I don't think they've put it together yet, but they will very soon. I believe in them. Iba and Dante are very, very intelligent. And a lot of things are coming like coming to a head right here about uh, like Dante's identity that will really make me uncomfortable. But hopefully it resolves soon. Her phone is either off or out of range of cellular signal. Yeah, so last time, and then she like turned off her phone. Are you worried about her? I mean, yesterday there was definitely something wrong. Yeah. I saw it in Mizuki's Somnium. Iris's body. Frozen solid. But Somniums are like of what have occurred and your brain processes it. Which means, so this is the, like, the super confusing part. Is that in the Somnium, like, you witness, like, a jumbled and exaggerated, like, a, you know, experience of past events. Which is why, you know, me seeing those two people and the person that killed or like heavily injured uh, Iris's mom, fucking creepy as shit, that already happened. And then this in the Somnium has also already happened. But Iris is obviously standing in front of us, which means that I, I guess she lives this experience. Something you like really isn't adding up here. Commiserate. I'm already tired of this, Iba. That's not like you. Is something wrong? Shogo's estimated TOD was two days ago, 5 p.m. It's been more than 48 hours. Turn on the audio just for a second. But our investigation has made zero progress. Sorry. I just wanted to whine about it for a bit. <laughs> I mean, you know what? Granted, right? 
Like, in I, five I, years, this is the first time I've heard you so dejected. Damn, it, it, it's really like taking a toll on him, I believe. Mm hmm. About me and Iba. Six years ago, I lost my past. Names, addresses, family, childhood, everything. But it, that wasn't all that I lost. My left eye. I don't know how I lost it. So here's the thing that really bugs me about the left eye thing. There's a very big left eye motif that's been like pushed to us from the beginning of the game. Like we lost our left eye and then we don't remember anything from before that. We don't remember how we lost it even. Uh, Shoko lost her left eye and is now dead. Uh, somebody else also was missing a left eye. Oh, it's the 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 bosses, the the, the Yakuza boss, his older brother, uh, lost his left eye and then became like a psycho. So a, a lot of people like lost their left eye. It seems in the past, have many days. My little good friend gave me a hand. Come with me, to where you belong. Mm hmm. Something like doesn't add up here, really. Boss helped me become a cop and assigned me to Abyss. A year later, I was called into the control room where Pewter showed me something extraordinary. The official title is AI Ball. AI Ball. You may call her Iba. The artificial intelligence contained within this sphere is nothing short of miraculous. I believe you, Peter. An autonomous artificial intelligence, birthed from collective nanotechnology. Its ability to think is controlled by a program we call the Wadget System. Yeah, and then he made this eyeball system, and then, like, the Wadget Eye is, like, you know, some... Special Agent Date, from today forward, this is your partner. Honestly, kind of fire concept. She will be your personal computer and your personal companion. Well, let's find out here. It's been five years since then. Five years and a number of tough cases. But... This time is different. What's different this time? Just scream. G -g Ghost! I have been here for several minutes now. <laughs> uh oh, scream about how she's there, Could I see. Could you not come out like that? Why not? If people see you, they'll freak out. No one will see her. Do not her. worry. I can only be seen by you. I am sending this projection of myself directly to your brain. I see. Oh. It's, it's not right. a hologram. It's like a... But returning to your answer, why would people freak out if they saw me? Because you're naked, that's why. Isn't it obvious? A girl looking like you, dressed like that, sitting next to me? People would think I'm a pervert. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> even though this is like, isn't she like based off of what you find attractive in a woman? Hmm. If you continue saying such things, I will self-destruct. You know what? I bet I would like that. I'm concerned about Renju. Where could Renju be? I also wonder where he could have gone. That's I would have called Mama at Marble. Oh, it's you, Dante. Oh, it's you, Dante. Hi, Mama. Do you know where Renju is? No, sorry. It's been a long time since I've seen Ren. Did something happen to him? Uh, I told Mama about Renju's ins uh, accident. About his disappearance from the hospital. Oh, no, really? Well, that was not a genuine, really. Yeah. Leave it to me. I'll contact you if I get any information. Thank you, Mama. Please do. All right. Now to Mama. Oh, to the other guy. Oh, MoMA, not Mama. MoMA and Mama, two different guys. What do you want? There's something I want to ask you. You know Renju Okiura, right? No point hiding it, right? Yeah, I know about Shoko's ex. I look to his fucking little face going up. I told MoMA about Renju's accident that he disappeared. Do you know where he is? Nope, sure don't. You know what? I, I, I believe this guy. It's not like we keep in touch or anything. Hey, MoMA. I've got a favor to ask. Can you get me information on Renj? His whereabouts, rumors on where he might be, anything. I need some leads. And what if I refuse? And your gang finds out you're the world's biggest ASAP fan. <sighs> in exchange for helping me, there's a reward in it for you. A reward? I'll let you meet ASAP. What? I met her yesterday at Lemniscate. We're acquaintances now. Really? Oh shit, dude. I, I was wondering when they were going to play that card. Cause I was gonna say, like, I, I know Iris and I could get I could pull a few strings. 
Yeah. You promise? Yeah, I... Nice. Good, 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 good. An AI never lies. An AI never lied. That's not true at all. So, you weren't kidding. What happens if you self-destruct in my eye socket? Then I die, right? Your skull would pop like a balloon. But then you'd also be dead, so it's a lose-lose for us, too. She's bluffing. My body is full of cutting-edge technology and state secrets. Mm. In terms of hardware, as well as software. I am capable of hacking 99.99% of computers that currently exist. Yeah, but not the computers when it counts, it seems. What if someone managed to steal me? It would threaten not only the police force, but the existence of the state itself. My self-destruct function is designed to prevent such a scenario from ever occurring. Mm-hmm. About your self-destruction. Strictly speaking, I am not capable of self-destructing. What do you mean? I obey the three laws of robotics as laid down by Isaac Asimov. Ah, yeah, 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 okay. So, I mean, basically, it means she can't do anything to actually harm us. Nor will she take action to for it. Myself. Yeah, you can't hurt yourself and you can't uh, hurt your... However, a person with administrative authority could order me to self-destruct. You will not disobey humans, you will not harm humans, and you can't hurt yourself. You have such authority. Oh, so something like that, right? Let us determine a code number, one that will activate the detonator. Nice, okay, let's let's do it. Command four one two zero five. Why four one two zero five? Upside down maybe? Two S O S O Z one A? If you issue this command, S O Z I A? I don't fucking no, know. No, that's still too dangerous. We need some kind of safety. The number will be the first lock. If I give you the second command within one minute of the first... What is the second command? 41205. 41205. Let's see. How about if I tell a lie? A lie? No, something that's not the truth. If I say something untrue, I want you to regard it as the second command. Interesting. Understood. Why did they pause for so long? And one more thing. Even if I die, do not worry. I will not be gone. Huh? Yeah, you're, she's in the cloud, right? Here is uploaded to the cloud. Yeah, exactly. All by wireless communication in real time. So th th there's no killing Iba, even if you wanted to, unless you, like, you know, <laughs> like deleted all of her files in the cloud as well. Even if my body is destroyed. My backup data will not be lost. And you can instantly, instantly make like a, a crazy backup data and like send it to a different location as well. You just like copy IBA multiple times. My memories as well as my core programming will be preserved. Yeah, so killing IBA is impossible. Horrible. Yes, as long as the server is alive. You'd need something fucked up. Shoko's number. Hey, about that five digit command, how did you come up with that number? It is my favorite number. Mm. There is no particular meaning. Hmm. Like, like now that she's, I, I, I used to trust Iba a lot, right? But now that she's told me that robots can't lie, or like AI doesn't lie, like it's made me more really, you know, suspicious of her. About Shoko Nadami's murder. Four one two uh, four one two zero five. We still need to see the investigation through. The only relevant lead is the call made to Shoko's phone. Yeah, Iba. Is that number still turned off? Please wait. Date, the line is connected. The line is connected, nice. Really? Really. Call it. Isn't your number being blocked? Try from a different line. You can do that, right? Yeah, she can I use can. a different number. Which line would you like to use? Mm, the line should we use here? Shoko's phone, a business line, my home phone, say you're from the cabaret club. This calling from Sugar's phone doesn't make any sense, does it? And a business line might be too sus- Like, definitely not my home phone. Cause then she'll know it's me. Wait, this is Shogo's phone, phone number, yes? Let's see. L l let's just choose one. Hold on, l l let's save really quickly here before we choose. Right here, save into slot 10. This is right before we choose a phone number. I'm not sure if there's a flowchart here. Let's find out. 
I usually like, you know, like I, I'm overly cautious when it comes to these kinds of things. Uh, not that it really matters, probably. Since this is probably like I probably try with all of them or some shit like that. Or it will matter regardless of what I choose. So let's use, let's, let's use the Abyss's line. No connection. Okay. Let's use, okay, it doesn't matter then. My home phone. No answer. Okay. Shogo's done. Yeah, I, I, I assume none, none of them will work. The caller did attempt to call Shogo's phone. Yeah, so maybe if we call back with Shogo's phone, they'll, they'll answer. If we call from that line. Right, he might pick up. But a normal call may yield the same results as before. Yeah, that's the issue. I have an idea. Do you remember what Shogo's voice sounded like? Yes, I do. I remember everything that I see and hear. Oh, we can have Iba pretend to be Shoko. Can you reproduce her voice? Analyzing recorded audio data. Dude, this, she's the deep fake of the deep. She's the deepest fake of the deep fakes. Imitation should be possible. Well then, this game came you out like a long time ago. No. Shoko's voice? Yeah. Me? You're the of only course. one who can. No, no, I can't do it. Fine. I suppose we have no choice. <laughs> it's like, why don't you do a Date? I'm like, I'm not a Date. I can't do that. Are you sure you can handle this? I am an artificial intelligence, not a human prone to nervous breakdowns and mistakes like you. Yeah, yeah, whatever. All right, Hal, let's see what you can do. <laughs> yeah, all right. All right, Hal. Oh, God. Guide the rocket, Hal. Let's see what you got. It picked up. Nice. It it's connected. It's ringing. <laughs> Look at her little hands. I thought you said you didn't get nervous. Uh, 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 Calm down. Deep breaths. Oh, God. Wait a minute. What? I'm an AI. I don't take breaths. <laughs> but you get nervous. Focus. They're going to hang up. Here we go. Um, hello. Oh, wow. This is Nadami Shoko. Impossible. Impo Shoko is dead. Shoko is dead? Whose voice is that? Yes, I died two days ago. Idiot, why did you say that? Oh, by I, I meant... Your twin sister. His name. Get his name! How? How do I get his name? Oh, God, dude. Oh, shit. Okay, save. This is where I really need to say. I didn't think we get this far. Okay, let's let's overwrite ten. Fuck it, whatever. We'll go from top top line next time. Let's see. Let's see. Tell me about package and need his address. Ask him for his name. Are you Yamada? Let's try this one first. Is this Yamada? No, this is... Say it, say... Are you sure you have the right number? Oh shit, okay, hold on. I don't want to save, I want to, I want to like, re, re, reload here. Is it possible? Oh, I knew I should have tried the other one, motherfucker! Okay, I, I just want to see what the other one says, yeah? So let's load from number 10. If we call him, I, I don't think like we'll get a name here regardless. I think the options don't really matter here. Because there's no split in the flowchart. I just kind of want to see what the other, the, other, the other one says. Okay. Let's see. He's gonna be an imposter. You're an imposter! I beg your pardon? Don't act dumb. You sound completely different. How did you get that phone? This is my phone. Liar! You're impersonating him! That's enough. I am so Sejima. Easy clap. Easy clap emoji. I am so Sejima. The congressman. A politician? Sejima. Damn. Sorry for doubting you. It's fine. What were you calling me for? Oh, uh, sorry, something urgent. I will call back later. 
Goodbye. I will call back later. Goodbye. But that was definitely so Sojima. So Sojima. Oh, public I, records of I see. It, it doesn't matter then. R regardless if you gave his name or not, we'd know. So Sojima's a. So Sojima. Not so Sojima. So Sojima. Not so comma Sojima, but so Sojima. Name is a minor celebrity. He goes on TV sometimes. Two days ago, he called Shoko. Why? In any case. That was an excellent performance, was it not? When you stopped being nervous, yeah, yeah I was. Is that all? What, do you want me to pat you on the head? Oh, she wants a little pat on the head? Oh, she's so cute. N no! Nothing like that. <laughs> mm. Tap my fingertip against my left eye. <laughs> stop! It tickles! Rub, rub, rub. Okay, you don't have to make you stop it. Make, you're making it weird now. Stop! The nerve might break! <laughs> Good fucking... <laughs> A call came in soon after. Is this my Dante, phone? A call from Investigation HQ. Connect me. Is this Special Agent Dante from Abyss? My name is Akaska from HQ. Akaska. I'm investigating the Shoko Nadami case. Oh, I see. There's something that you need to hear. Is it David Warren? What is it? We got a phone call earlier from a prisoner at Fuchu Prison. A prisoner of Fuchu Prison. A prisoner? We saved the call. I think you should give it a listen. Okay, here we go. Who is this? In here? I'm known as number 89. As number 89. What is this call concerning? I know who killed Shogun Adami. What? And if you let me out of here, I will tell you who it is. I suppose you might say I'm looking for a plea bargain. So prisoner number 89 knows Shogun Adami is the killer? He will kill again, you know. And he'll take their eye while they're still alive. There will be more bodies. There's like some psycho gone loose. Well, if you want to stop this serial killer, I suggest you take my offer. How does he know that though? I'll be seeing you. Damn, it gets crazy this now. This has to be a prank. That's what I thought too. But I felt I should give you the heads up anyway. Thanks. Just say thanks, David Warren. Good idea. Good luck. Do you think it really is just a prank? Well, to be sure, look into number 89. Yeah, I want to see his face. If, if 89 happens to be the face of that one guy, ooh. Roger that. But for now. Like the black hair guy from my So Sejima. Yeah, I guess it, it doesn't matter who we chose there. We would have been able to match Sojima's voice with his face via the AI intelligence. Let's bust down Sejima's door. There's one option I didn't choose yet. I shouldn't have chosen to, to call... Fuck me. Whatever. Just missing out some dialogue options. Whatever. Hey, you can't be here without permission. I'll call the police! I am the police. What happened? Sir. Uh, uh, police officer. I am the police, stupid guy. You. He knows me. I don't know him, though. Uh, I, it seems like everybody knows me, but I don't can know I anybody. I need to ask you a Wh few why questions. Why is that? I'm a very busy man. You can ask me tomorrow during normal business hours. Nope. Not today, buddy. It's about Shoko Nadami. You can't tell me you've never heard of her. As a matter of fact, I have. It was reported on the news that she was killed. Mm, Two days ago you're playing at 9 safe. 2 p.m., you made a phone call to Shoko Nadami. A phone call? I don't know what you're talking about. Nice try, idiot. Yes, you do. Oh, we're, 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 we're doing a thing now. Okay. Topiary. A big... That's a big kabosu. Here comes the... No, wait. That's a bush. It's a nice bush. Not a kabosu. Look, Date, Your favorite cabaret girl is here. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? That, is it her? a lantern. Reka isn't that sturdy. Reka isn't that sturdy? Hit the sturdy? <laughs> a garden stone mansion. The Sejima residence. Hmm. Tree. A tree. A tree. Cool. The sky. I can't click. Mansion. I can't click. Ooh, what's that? A vase. I can't click that either. Mr. Bodyguard. What's your name, sir? What's your name? Can't say a word. You got a girlfriend? Got a girlfriend? Didn't think so. I'm married. Oh, he spoke this time. This guy's domestic. This guy's domestic. Normalcy must be punished by death. How dare he be 
d married? What's your blood? What's your blood type, sir? What's your blood type? Okay, I'll guess. You're a B. Definitely a B. My was gonna say A B. You're being rude. I knew it. That attitude is so B of you. Is it? A bodyguard. I can't tell this guy apart. So let's call him A. A is standing here. Not really anything to look at around here. I'll be on what island? The small island that's in the pond. I have a look. A kappa. A kappa. Kappa. He is a wealthy, powerful man. It is not surprising that he owns a pet kappa. <laughs> the kappas aren't real. Really? Really? No, there's no kappa. Where is the kappa? Give me cucumbers. Oh my God! He does own a kappa. I think I heard a strange voice. Oh my God! He. D I, I, I'm sorry. I doubted you, sir. He. I thought kappas weren't real. An arch-shaped stone bridge over the pond. Damn, he actually does own a kappa, dude. He's a big shot. My bad, my bad. I'm sorry. Is that a line of me? Your boss is a liar, you know. Your boss is a liar, you know. Aren't all politicians? <laughs> yeah. That's surprisingly honest. I agree. I like this guy, B. Hey, how much do you get paid? What? I'm talking about cash, my friend. I rub my thumb against my pointed finger in a circle. Oh yeah, money. Mula. Probably double what you make. Not true. Not true. Hey, hold on, sir. Really? Iba, bring up a job search website. On it. This is so petty. Don't those sunglasses make it hard to see? He wears his sunglasses at night. So he can, so he can. No reaction. Yes, he really can't see well in those. A bodyguard. Because I can't tell these guys apart. I'll be, uh, he, this one will be B. B is standing here. Okay, so thermo time. He's red hot, like a like the sun. So much blood. Where's all this red coming from? It's a thermograph. Yeah, I knew that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, he's lying. How do I get him to admit it? Okay, let's see. How will make him confess to his killer? Call him. Bribe him. Oh, I can do. I can call him right here. Peel off his nails, look. Yeah, peel off his nails real quick. I should get some pliers and take his nails off. Oh, the, the tried and true torture device. I thought that wasn't your style. Shut the fuck up. Bribe him? Threaten him with your gun. Maybe I'll pull out my gun. That would result in heavy disciplinary action. Thank you. Okay, bribe him. I'll give you one million. Only one million. Only one million. Only. That's the kind of world he lives in. Only one million, I guess. A couple million would be... Let's, let's call him on his phone, or my phone, or Shoko's phone with... You, you get it. Whatever. Iba, call his phone again, using Shoko's line. Understood. You're not gonna pick it up? It's from Shoko. I had her give you a call. What? It'll stop ringing soon. Three, two... One. See? Oh, dude, that's Dante. That is cold. Wow. Fine. I did call her. Okay. Around nine o'clock, just like you said. Finally confessing? There's Finally. nothing to confess. I did nothing wrong. Probably true, actually. Then why did you lie to me? Because I didn't want to get involved in all of this nonsense. You mean to tell me that? I am a suspect. Well, you didn't have to be if you weren't so suspicious. My call was after Shoko died. If I were the killer, why would I do that? I don't know, but I'm asking the questions. Do you have a warrant? I thought not. I'll be leaving now. Good night, detective. Damn, he, he pulled the no warrant card on me. Mother, I'll be, I'll be back with a warrant, bro. Go I'm... home, unless you want to get kicked out. <laughs> Guess I'll just leave. So, so, about So's alibi. Do you know where So was Friday at 5 p.m.? Here, in the mansion. Can anyone corroborate that? Maybe the housekeeper. Oh, well, well, like all of the guards, maybe. <laughs> 70 I don't know guards. what you're talking about. Okay. What's the relationship between So and Shoko? I don't know. Even if I did, it would be confidential. Hmm, good answers. So's bodyguard is in my way. Can I just, like, sneak through? Do you know Shoko Nami? I've heard of her, but I've never met her. I saw her on the news. Okay, look at you have anything suspicious about so recently? No, 
Nothing special. Not any different from any other politician anyway. Date, a minute. Okay. What happened? So is on the move. Most likely in a car. How do you know? I hacked So's smartphone and I'm currently tracking the GPS. Smart not his rental phone. The one registered under his name. Where is he headed? Unknown. Somewhere to the east. Okay. Keep tracking him. Roger that. Oh fuck, I didn't get to talk about- it. No! I, I wanted to save it for last. Oh, I'm so sad. We'll get it on another playthrough, maybe. Damn, there's so many options now. N now they're introducing, like, like, before they would let us, like, check all the options beforehand. But now- Oh, no. Oh, no. This is bad, not the warehouse. This is where people go to die. People die in a warehouse. This is terrible. Okay, cool. That's So's car. Okay, the doors are opening. Totally didn't see me, I guess. Interesting. Dude, he fucking peeled away fast, hardcore. What was So doing here? Date, my apologies. She's low on battery? What's wrong? My battery is low. Are you serious? This is not going to be a problem. I can still see out of my right eye. My vision is half and I went to the warehouse. This is bad though. Without Iba, it's hard for me to get things done without Iba. Iba makes everything so easy. It's cold in here. Iris' dead body is in here. Am I too- was it actually a vision of the future? Am I too late? Why does it have to be so ominous? Hold on. Forklift? A forklift. Overhead crane. It's- it's not right without- f Fuck, dude. No, oh, drum. Without fucking Iba's, like, quips, you know, it feels so lonely in here. Shells. There's not a lot here. It's a warehouse not in use. Forklift B. A forklift. Ice cutting machine. An ice cutting machine. Yeah, like, no, no nonsense today. It's just all clinical observations. Alright, fine. Let's be covered on a white cloth on the table. Oh, shit. Here we go. Whose body is it? It can't be. Oh, shit. Really? Are you for real? God fucking damn it. Iris. Iris is dead. Iris is dead! So it was a vision of the future. How did she know that, though? Iba, what's your charge? Currently at 2%. Can you make a call? I can. I am connected to the power supply. What do you... Hurry. Just connect me to boss. Oh, shit. We gotta go. Date, what's wrong? I found a body. What? She was murdered. Multiple stab wounds to the back. And one eye missing. Oh, no. Location is Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. The victim... The victim is Iris Sagan. Iris? I'll tell you more later. We Just gotta send go. CSI to the we scene We gotta right go, away. dude. And one more thing. Congressman So Sejima. Bring him to Abyss. Wait a minute, why? I'll take responsibility for everything. Just do it, please. <sighs> All right. We, we got him on lock, guys. We got him on fucking lock. Damn, Iris is dead? Fuck. I isn't she my daughter? Don't flashback me now. This is heartbreaking. No oh, shit. But that's a different screenshot. Or that that's a different Has image though. Time real soon? She wasn't in the I'm same pose. God damn it. Yeah, this is bad. You shouldn't do that when you're driving though, you might crash. Here we go. At the headquarters. It gets now it's getting crazy, guys. Now it's getting crazy. Am I good cop or bad cop here? 
Do you honestly think you can get away with this? Funny. I was gonna ask you the same thing. Date, calm down. You know Iris Sagan, don't you? No, I don't. Mm. I've never heard of her. Maybe he's lying, maybe not. But even if he doesn't know her name... Visitor at 2 a.m. Wait, what, what is this? What? Show tab? Information isn't relevant? Iris's picture. I put a picture of Iris in front of So. So you've never met her before? I have not. Have you seen her corpse? Corpse? I know you've seen her body. Based on what? Based on what? Iris' time of death, Iris, so, so leaving the warehouse. There's something else. Irrelevant. Time of death? Not it. Okay, the, these two together, right? Iris's body was found at Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. So I, I'm getting used to controls right now. I have to press tab in order to confirm. I thought it would like be like tab to like check. What does that have to do with anything? I simply went to the corner of the room, picked up the PC monitor, and put it in the desk in front of him. This, Iba, play the video right away. Gotcha, front and center, buddy. With a name and everything, buddy. Idiot. I see. Then I suppose you know I was there. The, yeah, the, no shit, Sherlock. Then you saw the body. I didn't. I was at the warehouse, but I didn't see any corpses there. Don't lie to me! It's the truth. Then what were you doing there? He won't say. I choose to remain silent. Oh, plain the fifth, huh? You what? Remain silent, as is my right, guaranteed by law. <sighs> it's true. Remember that I am a politician. He knows he shouldn't be running his mouth. I know my rights. Date, can I get a second? Yeah, boss. What? Br breather me, please. Does it please. matter if he saw the body or not in this case? No, it He's doesn't. He's a busy man. If we hold him here too long... You want me to stop beating around the bush? I certainly do. You believe that Sosajima is her killer, or is at the very least involved in the crime somehow. Yeah. Why not ask him for his alibi? First? I don't think Sojima is the killer. It's it's too it's too much. Let's see. Iris was live streaming until 2 a.m. today. Someone visited her and interrupted the stream. I hadn't been in contact with her for a while. Whoever visited her this morning almost certainly has something to do with the murder. Yeah. Okay, what is this? I was thinking about how Iris's body was frozen when I discovered it. So she was dead for a long time. It must have taken at least 18 hours for the body to freeze to that state. I entered the warehouse at 9 p.m. 18 hours prior to that was 3 a.m. Iris was last seen alive around 2 a.m. She was live streaming, so there's no doubt about the time. Meaning Iris must have been murdered between 2 and 3 in the morning. Okay. That's not what I wanted. There we go, that's what I wanted. Iris was killed sometime between 2 and 3 in the morning. Do you have an alibi for that time? I was playing Mahjong all night. Mm. At a place called Dora Dora in Shinjuku. Politician spending all night in a Mahjong parlor. That sounds about normal to me, actually. An exclusive Mahjong parlor, yes. Yes, you know, it's, it's to build rapport and relations. It's Mahjong, you should have had three opponents with you. Indeed I did, but they were all strangers. I don't remember their names. Hmm, interesting. Dante, I did some research. Dora Dora is a private room Mahjong parlor. It is Interesting. owned and operated by one individual. Who is it? If the rooms are private, that limits the number of potential witnesses. The shopkeeper might be in So's pocket. He's the only one we could ask about So's alibi. Especially if he doesn't remember any of the three people he played against. He might as well not have an alibi. That's not much of an alibi, So. It really isn't. Please, this is ridiculous. First you suspect me in the matter of Shoko Nadami, and now this? I haven't killed anyone. Not Shoko, not Iris. Besides, if I stabbed a woman, why would I bring her to a cold storage warehouse? How did he know that he was she was stabbed? I didn't. She said she, he said he didn't see any corpses. Wait, what did you say? So didn't respond. But remember, he slipped up. If I stabbed the woman, so he does know about the corpse because Iris' autopsy report. 
I never mentioned Iris's cause of death. How do you know she was stabbed? Because... Gotcha, so stupid politician ass motherfucker. Because you did it? Don't be stupid. Then how do you know? Stop dodging the question and answer. <clears throat> I'm vindictive today, guys. Boss, give me permission to sink. He can't hide inside his own head. You've got it. Sink with him. Let's go, boss. Me and you. Alright, so... Six minutes of me and you in the... Will not affect Thanks, Pewter. Okay, I love Pewter, dude. Let's do it. <laughs> fucking right. boss is fucking cleavage. Middle center for the, the screen. Don't forget the six minute time limit. I know. You say it every time. We're sinking. Let us begin. Here we go. With the crack this case wide open, motherfucker. I don't think so is the killer still. Like he doesn't have He looks like a weak ass motherfucker. He looks like he's scrawny as fuck. I don't know. He's it's it's too much for a politician, dude. What a wacky side hobby. We'll bust into the crime scene. Let's go. <laughs> nice landing. Nice landing, Iva. Did you witness my superior driving technique? I did. Yeah, I saw you get in an accident. No! I only pressed the wrong pedal! <laughs> that's what you call an accident. Yep, that's, uh, yeah, exactly. Oh, look at that. Don't change the subject. Observe the surroundings. Huh. It's, a, it's wacky in here, dude. Huh. It's no wacky in exists. here. Maybe this is So's corrupt nature manifesting itself. The man's Somnium is almost as corrupt as he is. I am impressed. Uh, never mind. Yeah, this is a real bad dream. Let's get the clues we need and get the hell out of- There's- sh wait, there's Iris. It's Iris? What on earth is she doing here? That means he was there to witness that, no? We should follow her. Oh, there's the killer. But the killer is in purple. It's purple guy from Five Nights at Freddy. Uh, holy shit, dude. Purple guy went out. <laughs> holy moly. Ravioli. Iris. Spaghetti pasta linguine. We can't go any closer. We cannot. That silhouette we saw. This is so somnium. During a sink, we experience the subject's dreams from a third person perspective. But then it would be him if he was a killer, no? In other words. It has to be him. I cannot say for certain, but probably. What the fuck? It just replays. What's going on? It appears that time is looping in this warped space. Time is looping? Can't you do something about that? What exactly do you propose I do? I don't know, stop, move time? You're telling me I have to watch this scene over and over? I don't want to watch it either. Well then? I think it's way too fast to be show, uh, so Sejima. I suppose we can help her. We may then be able to ask this manifestation of Iris some questions. Huh? Sure, do whatever you gotta do. Okay, yes. let's try to stop this we first. Have to yeah. Now in the Somnium. But to do that, we gotta do something about that huge wooden box. <laughs> what a weird dream logic. Somnium scan, activate. I don't remember how to do a Somnium, guys. <laughs> I might fuck it up the first time, I won't lie to you. Mental number one is the box. Number two is a, a more boxes, okay? Number three is even more boxes. Where am I going? What? Where is that, dude? In the, in the alleyway? Okay, mental log 3 is the alleyway. And 4 is another box. <laughs> so many boxes to crush through here. If Iris escapes, you may discover so secret. Okay, cool. Menu, before we continue on, let's save. Let's even slot 1 here. 
Okay. Okay, you know what? What is around here? Map. See, current objects on the map here. We lost one on save time. So we are here. There's some stuff we can check here. There's a warehouse, a couple doors in the corner of the box. A large wooden box. Okay, we can hit the box. We can push the box. Let's investigate first. This box is too large to exist in reality. This must be a reflection of So's deepest psyche. It's deepest psyche? He definitely doesn't want us going any further. It seems that way. This guy's a pain in the ass, even in his dream. In any case, moving this box may take some ingenuity. Forklift time. Okay, let's see. Let's hit the forklift real quick. A forklift? What is this? 2x death? What is 2x? Let's find out, you guys. Roger that. It is time to un- Didn't you crash a minute ago? Besides, the forklift is front-wheel drive. Okay, good. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, that's it? That's all you got to say? You gotta say nothing about that? What is this? There's something here. Maybe you should jump in. It might unlock a bonus stage. <laughs> Do you have the mind of a child? Pick up a time that's negative effect. Negative times can multiply time or force you to use them. If you pick one up, be careful. Double time, I see. A mysterious warp space suddenly appeared. 10 seconds, 40 seconds. Let's, uh, let... Let's, let's, let's scream at it to get 30 seconds. Hello! Shut... <laughs> Hello! Okay, portal A. A portal. Five minutes left, Date. Pebbles inside. Nice. So we can break it. Appears it to be connected to that place. Sound makes it hard to believe it was a pebble. Anything we, we just need to break the box. Or we a can portal. pick it up from here. Put your hand in it. Here? Yeah. My hand Yeah, you can do it. I suppose if I'm Does it appears big on the other side, right? Nice. Fantastic. Oh, I've seen a boss character like this before. <laughs> Master Hand! So we're going now. Now for the l large row of boxes. She makes it this far and she dies again, right? Uh, yeah. Are those boxes in the way too? We do not have time to move each one. If only we could use that crane. We could use the crane if we just walk over there. Okay. A warehouse. Knock on the door. Is anyone there? No response. Even if there was someone there, they might not answer. Okay. Just pick up a. Let's walk through here then. A door to the warehouse. I cannot see inside. Go in, peek inside. Let's go in. Fuck it. What's the worst that could happen? I die? Oh shit, maybe for real. <laughs> huh? That door should have led to the warehouse. Wait, where am I now? Four minutes. Oh, it takes us over here. Jeez. What's door A? A warehouse. Listen. 
I hear the sound of scraping metal. Sounds dangerous. Okay, cool. So I can't walk around here. A warehouse. Enter. I guess we can only go in. Delivery. Damn, I wasted so much time doing that. West door E. A warehouse. Fuck me, dude. Times four and fuck. Can I go through here? I can totally squeeze through here. No? I can't squeeze through there either. What is that thing on the ground? Three minutes, Date. Concrete fragments. Pieces of concrete. Kick it. Okay, stupid. Are you okay? I want to go. It's okay. Don't push your. Stop it. Try to be nice. Makes me want to cry. Okay, don't cry. A warehouse. Listen. I keep forgetting to use the the timies. I hear laugh, but they're far away. Door A H. Warehouse. Listen. I hear the sound of dripping liquid. A cake. By liquid, do you mean? Unknown. Damn, that's crazy. A warehouse. Okay, let's use our tenth time to listen, to knock. Is anyone? No response. Even if there was someone there. A warehouse door. Let's use one fifth time on the door to listen. I hear a dull impact at regular in- Damn. This is all just sounds of murder, it seems. This is all I got right now. This is all I got right now. Why does Pete- Isn't that perfectly normal to say in this situation? You sound like the kind of man who uses the word trim unironically. What do you mean trim unironically? That isn't important right now. So I was right. No! Just look, please. Well, if you really want me to... Oh my. What is it? Just Shut up, pervert. Okay, let's use the map here. I don't got much choice, it seems. Okay. Let's go. A door to the warehouse. I don't think I'll be able to make it this time. I only have two minutes left to clutch it. And the chances of that are pretty slim. I waste a lot of time just checking things out, which, you know, it's cool to be curious. You have less than two minutes, Date. Hurry. Is this some kind of control? Let's see. Put input fighting game combo. Raise the lever. Lower the lever. Let's uh let's change it to ten seconds. We'll lo we'll raise the lever. <laughs> no. Got it. Well. Change it's it a to control panel. To twenty seconds and lower the lever. <laughs> no. Got it. Input the fighting game combo. This is it, guys. It's a control panel. 20 seconds they input the fighting game combo. The one that is difficult. Yeah, the GH raging combo. Fine, just be quiet. No, wait. Inputting that. I think you can do it. I'll try. <laughs> Holy shit. It totally was the fighting game combo. Nice. So sick, so sick. Oh, 100 Ooh. seconds left. Ring out! That's a KO! 100 seconds left! Barrels. If only she could fit through that gap. Meant to lock two. Checkpoint saved. Ok, 
Okay, where is she? She is over there. I have to go back through. You have one minute left. A warehouse. Ten seconds to answer. I don't. I don't think I'll make it here. But we can. We can still try. Or D. A warehouse. Open the D door. What's this? Something came out. Edible seaweed made this way was thought to be a delicacy for nobles during the Heian era. Nobody <laughs> Thank you. needs to hear your superfluous narration. She became a small creature. Just the one left then. I'm s I'm so sad. I could have I could have definitely beat this the first time. That's what I get for, you know, trying to <laughs> look at cool shit. Why did he become small too? Hanging from the crane in the way now. Was there something under the wooden box? Let's just go back and lift it up for now. Damn, that's crazy. Date. Damn you, so. Okay, let's try again. Let us try that again. Okay, let, let's let's do this from the beginning here. I'm gonna spin out of order here. And now we know what to do, so we're Did gonna speed run it. my superior drive? Okay, skip. It's kind of funny the second time around. I won't be. I'll be honest. Here we go. Okay, here we go. First and foremost, a forklift. Kick the forklift or drive the forklift. Let's drive it. Roger that. It is time. Didn't you okay. the size the forklift? Cool. There's do you Portal A. A mysterious warps. We we have to let's see. Put your hand down it. Forty seconds to do it. Here? Fine. Yeah. My hand. That opens up the next area. Remove the large box. Next. Five minutes left, Dante. A door to the warehouse. Just go in right now. Okay, good. Is this some half time for the, the combo? Sure, why not? The one that is difficult. Okay, good. A warehouse. Go inside. Delip. Oh shit, okay. And then we open warehouse B. A warehouse. And now to the last mental lock here. Door C. Three minutes, Dante. Knock on the listen first. I hear deep ex Don't tell me. Is it a Is it a panty snatcher? I don't think so. This one this one has like a, a skull when I want to knock on the door. Let's try it. No response. What it looks like a peek inside the door. Twenty seconds. Oh. If you got any smaller, you'd be. This is a mysterious. 
You have less than two minutes. I, I can only peek Hurry. inside. Damn, that's crazy. Maybe this door then. A warehouse. Let's uh, let's listen. I said listen. Is anyone there? No response. Even if there was someone there. I, I said listen, house? not. Oh, this is my bad. I can't interact with this thing. A wooden oh, I can't interact with this thing. Push it. Push it real good. No use. It is either stuck to the ground or its cargo is extraordinarily Damn. heavy. Or you're just weak. Or your instructions are bad. Or you're just Or your breath <laughs> smells like garbage. <laughs> nice try though. A wooden box hanging from a crane. Okay. Let's try punching it with the timing. It won't even nice try though a crit let's see tackle throw something peek inside there is no point to it if we are going to move it okay cool a crane two seconds a crane. You have one minute left. Ride? Not that I am. So I need something else so I can ride it, huh? What is this? What? So be acquired. Fuck. What is this? Data, you've got less than 30 seconds. I never saw that before. A warehouse. Damn, I wish I could get there. A warehouse. Maybe one of the other doors opens it, Deliver. huh? Damn, how do I get up there? Oh, I could just done this. Cool. Is this some kind of Let's see. Input the fighting game combo? Let's see. Raise the lever. Understood. Very good. Is there something underneath it? Do we do it? Do we fucking do it? Holy smoly, Batman. She's running. But we didn't actually save her, though. We saved her only in this reality. She jumps. They jump. She lands. He lands. Now we can stop him. Got him, Batman. Stupid guy. So we did it. Right? It appears Iris was saved. Barely. <laughs> yeah, just barely, it seems. That shadow must be. Who is it? Who is that? Don't, don't, don't leave me hanging here. Jeez. Twelve seconds remaining, even on our, oh, six seconds remaining, even on our second pass through. We got so B as well, didn't we? We have both of those. We got the eyeball for so B. As well as so A. So this is a, this is a, this is a forking road. Damn, that's crazy. Day three, Sunday. Q's AI. I wonder what this shit means. Iris was in the Somnium earlier. Yeah. Yes, we saw. An unidentified figure tried to stab Iris to death. But he w but he needs to know that, right? His and hmm. Date and Iba. Who is that figure? Probably so himself. True, he could imagine himself in his Somnium that way. Mr. Date's ego algorithm processed the figure into that particular image. 
Damn, was it? It can't be so, though. What are you people talking about? If you're quite done here, hurry up and release me. We're not gonna be done here, buddy. You're gonna, we're gonna have a long, stern talking to me and you, mano a mano. Next time, though. <laughs> this is where we're gonna end up for today, guys. Right before we talk to So, after being insomnium, we're gonna cut it short right there. Because it's been almost about an hour here. Or maybe even an hour. I can't read time, it seems. But yeah, uh, we beat the Somnium after a, a number of tries. Uh, which was, dude, it's really cool. <laughs> it's sad that I have to, like, you know, like, fail through the Somnium a couple times. To, like, to see all of the possible, like, things you can click on. Because those, like, doors or whatever, like, they're all just, like, you know, behind the warehouses are, like, killings, right? Like, happening. I don't know, it's hard to say. Like, I don't want So to be the killer just because it seems it feels a little too early for So to like for us to catch the killer, it seems. But other than that, um, very cool Somnium. Uh very wacky. <laughs> and putting the fighting game combo seems to work against uh levers these days. But yeah, uh <sighs> Uh we managed to save Iris inside the Somnium, which means we may be able to ask. We didn't get to ask Iris any questions, it seems, but we may be able to ask So some questions since we lived and we, let's see. I'm assuming there's like a branch off path here. Like, yeah, we chose option B or, let me see. Hard to say. Can we go up the flowchart, please? So the, yeah, there might be another branching off here if we were unable to like um, save her in the Somnium here. But we were able to save her in the Somnium after a couple of retries. Which will now put us here in Day 3 Sunday Q's AI at the AI Abyss base. Next time we we'll, uh, catch back up here, we're going to identify <laughs> what exactly so has to do with the murders. But until then, I'm going to return to the top menu. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, guys. Um, hopefully you enjoyed the playthrough so far. It's an exciting game with an exciting uh, <laughs> story that's unfolding here in front of us. But if you did enjoy and you would like to see more videos in the future, including AI and maybe other videos as well, please uh, make sure you click the subscribe button. Uh, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss the next video drop. Also, if you like this video in particular, don't forget to like and subscribe. Like and uh, comment, sorry. <laughs> Can't even uh, say my words at the end of the outro here properly. But yeah, like and uh, comment so you, uh, I know that you enjoyed it. You know, it's nice feedback. It's always good and helpful for me. But yeah, uh, other than that, that's going to be it. Uh, I will see you guys probably next time on AI The Somnium Files. For now, drink some water. Touch some butter. Save some girls inside a Somnium. And I'll see you guys next time. Okay, peace. Peace of peace. Late.